The place that we're going to now is a place that we've been to before in the past, and it is Hoyoverse's account for the Leak Hunter decree. Now, this happened back in Genshin Impact, and it hasn't really seen any grounds lately. We've seen no reports of leakers getting obliterated until today. So I want to take you back in time to another content creator called Matt Jestic, who I had a problem with because when people monetize leaks on YouTube and put leaks leaks and thumbnails where YouTube has a search engine optimization system. There's no spoiler system to hide thumbnails and people post leaks on your timeline. And if you watch Genshin Impact, they would be recommended to you, which means essentially the leaks would then become spoilers for any of you who want to play the game spoiler free, which is something that I have a great problem with. But first, a word from today's sponsors. You've probably heard of this one before. Wizard 101, a game that's been around for quite a while and it's free and you can download it right now if you want to try it out for yourself. But in case you don't know what it is, let me break it down for you. Wizard 101 is an MMO adventure game with magic schools, worlds with expansive stories, and friends around every street. Wizards team up with their friends to learn spells and complete magical quests in the spiral. Try your hand at seven schools of magic and battle tough foes, tricky bosses, and even other wizards. Join over 50 million other wizards online in this MMO. Hone your inner magic and help save the spiral in a nostalgic turn-based RPG, CCG MMORPG. Try Wizard 101 for free now using the link in my pinned comment or my description. And Wizard 101, thank you for sponsoring today's video. Now, a thing that I don't have a problem with is leaks on like private discords or leaks on reddits where one, it's not monetizable. That way nobody will do it for vulturistic means or for a means to an end. Uh, you know, they're just doing it because they want to help people prepare. It's very wholesome. It's very nice, right? And the reason why it's different and the reason why I don't like monetizing leaks is because there are a lot of people who just don't want to see that content. They're going to see it whether they like it or not. And it is like game ruining content. It is. If you don't want to see it, if you want the excitement and it spoils that for you, it sucks because Hoyoverse, once again, they're a million dollar company, not even close to a billion dollar company, which I feel no real reason to actually go out and defend because let's be real, no matter how much leaks hurt their feelings, if they cry, well, they can wipe it with a hundred dollars bills that all of them have in their pocket but leaks are good when you choose to go see them especially for free to play players where you can go see them prepare for the future and that way you can save your crystals which is something that Hoyoverse doesn't want you to do because at the end of the day remember this before you pull before anything or before you even play remember that gacha games are designed to take your money they are. Now, don't get me wrong. Honkai Star Rail is a very good gotcha game. I do think it unironically is the best gotcha game ever made, my opinion, for me, right? I can't speak for you, but for me, it's my favorite one I've ever played. And I've played a lot uh, because it is, there's there's not that much FOMO on this besides banners, right? The, the fact that the events come back and you get to do them is very nice. I enjoy that shit quite a lot. So Matt Jessica got taken down as well as many other creators of Genshin Impact got taken down for posting leaks on YouTube as well as Reddit and Discord, which does suck for the latter half. But it seems as of, I think this is June 23rd. So five days ago, there's a content creator called Sip Sip Steven, which is really funny because I this, this guy thought I had a problem a problem with him the other day because I was talking about a TikTok creator, but instead he took it as all TikTok creators. And all I said was, is that people who watch Genshin Impact content creators on TikTok, their, their fan bases were rabid and like sucked their balls, right? It wasn't even a shit talk. It was kind of just saying, hey man, your fans are incredibly rabid. Like, congrats, bro. You can do anything. They're, they're with you for life. So I don't know why Sip Sip Steven thought I was a... a, a making fun of him. I wasn't. I actually like Sip Sip Steven stuff quite a bit. He makes very, very, very good guides, but it is what it is. I understand people misunderstand me. That's, that's part of life. That's part of the reality. But apparently Sip Sip Steven got absolutely railed, railed harder than Chat's mom at twitch.tv forward slash techdone every night by me, baby. Okay, I need to stop. I was being so professional. I, was, I almost went a whole video without doing that. Important, this is a message to all leakers and reposters. I have indeed received a cease and desist from Hoyo versus lawyers for reposting of leaked content. In case you don't know what a cease and desist letter is, it pretty much means stop what you're doing right now and never continue it or we are going to kill you that's or at least financially right that's pretty much what that means i've been told further legal action will take place if i fail to comply please be careful i cannot show the document due to confidentiality this will be the end of leak related content for me across all platforms stay safe everyone also get ahead of my comments i am not looking for sympathy i'm just posting to warn other people in the space yes if you are posting straight up leaks even showing them on stream you are in trouble of getting absolutely obliterated that's why leaks should stay in like private reddits private discords 
And, you know, you try to get ahead any way that you can, but just remember there is a risk that goes along with it. Now, do I agree with Hoyoverse wanting to prevent leaks? Yes. Here's my issue, Hoyoverse. I have never seen a company have more leaks in my whole life. You are a million dollar company that will probably soon be a billion dollar company, yet you cannot afford cybersecurity measures to prevent this information from getting out because I swear to God, even for Genshin Impact, you leaked all of like 4.0 like six months ago. So I don't know how the f you are constructing this, how you do the, the contracts for the NDAs for the closed beta access, but I just don't know how all this information is getting out and you feel so helpless with this shit. It borderline feels intentional, but then when people like this get punished for covering those blatant leaks, and I mean blatantly, like you can go anywhere. You can find anything. You can probably find until 2.0. I'm not even kidding you. Every single character from now until 2.0 has already been leaked. I'm not even kidding you. I have seen them all. And once again, I didn't want to see them, but I got shown them because there was a YouTube video on it. So here's the thing. Do I agree with Hoyo versus policy of removing the leak? Yes, it's their intellectual property. If they don't want people seeing it in advance, they have every right to do whatever the f they want to anybody they want to. Now, I would be fine if they just prevented that on YouTube and Twitter, right? Where there's like search engines or even Twitch where you can see the thumbnails without actually looking for them. I wouldn't mind if they would go after that, but to, to go after people on Reddit and Discord who aren't making profit, who people only go to see that, whether you just have to, you, you have to actually look for it. That's where I kind of draw the line. I think that's pretty shitty but I totally get it. They have every right to do so. Now, what I like to say, f you hoyo verse, take your leaks and shove them up your ass. I'm gonna do whatever the fuck I want. Hey, f you, man. Hey, I'm just trying to save a dollar, bro. I'm out here fighting to survive. I made $600 this month. I dropped $200 on the low banner. I gave you 33% of my income. It is my American right to see whatever I want to see. Hey, if you didn't want me to see it, your ass should have kept that shit locked up. Obviously, I do want to say that, but the reality is, hey, that's okay, man. The pro I mean, listen, leaks are a lot of the times good for the game because they get players excited for things to come, but that being said, it, it kind of misses the uh, the old razzmatazz, the theatrics, the show works, right? They have these they have these live streams every six weeks where they say, hey, here's what we did. This is what we're gonna do. I hope you're all excited. And they present it in a very fun way. They put a lot of effort into it. They could probably put in more effort into it with all the money they make, but it is what it is. I totally get why they're doing that, but I do just wanna let you guys know that if you are a leaker, a blatant leaker, please be careful because you are absolutely playing with fire and you need to realize that. Now, as far as my content goes, I don't leak. I have dreams. And it's very different because my brain, I'm like a shaman, right? And I can see the spirits. And the spirits, they talk to me and they tell me things. My, my The voices in my head, they talk to me, they counsel me, and they let me know what's coming because I am different than these other human beings. So if you're wondering if my content will change, no, because I don't leak. I merely speak truths. I merely I, I'm merely a soothsayer, a, 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 a shaman. I can pull it out from what's ethereal and make it reality. So my content will not change because I have never leaked, but I have shared my dreams before. That being said, if you're a leaker on, uh, you know, any social media site, just be careful because they are going to come for you. And uh, to be fair, they have every right to do so, in my opinion. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think down in the comments. And uh, for all leak channels, peace. If you need more content leakers, here's what you can do. Maybe start going to sleep and having a couple more dreams. Catch you on the next one. Peace.